And uh, I mean, is this a game you guys are, you know, pretty we're, we're excited about? We're playing Duke, and that's all that matters. Yeah. Um, I was just saying, it, it doesn't matter if it's the regular season, ACC play, um, more specifically playoffs or the, the NCAA tournament. If we're playing Duke, we're excited. They're a rival. Um, they've had the upper hand on us in my four years here. You know, they've beat us more consistently. Uh, but we beat them last year in the ACC playoffs, which I think was a confidence booster for us, you know, knowing that we can actually beat them up until mm -hmm. that point we had in, in my career. Um, and so we're, you know, they're a very good team this year. They lost two of their top point scores last year, but they're still more than capable. They're coming off a loss this weekend, so they'll be hungry. Um, but at the same time, we're kind of, you know, smell the blood in the water a little bit, like to strike while they're down. Um, but they'll, they'll be capable. Uh, sigh of relief a little bit after last week to get back on the winning track. And, I mean, oh that, that could have been bad going yeah, into this week, absolutely. three losses. Right? Yeah, um, I've been a little bit spoiled over my four years here. I've never lost back-to-back -back games. Um, so when we lost those two in a row, you know, everyone kind of was panicking and, you know, wait, what's going on here? Are we doing something wrong? And, um, you know, you couple that with some stuff that happened off the field. We had some suspensions and we lose Matt Lovejoy. Um, and so there were kind of a lot of negative things going on. And we just can, I mean, we sat down the week before the game. We're like, listen, we got to put all this stuff aside. You know, no one person defines a team. We're more than capable here with everyone in this group. Um, and, you know, we, we found a way to win.